Have you we've done the one, we shouldn't be able to do the other. Would you explain your reasons for Roy for coming to London at this precise time? Well, I came to London uh, because I wanted to get a, try and get a clear understanding of what the British government's own ideas were in the doubt of the future of the Federation. The Northern Rhodesian constitutional announcement, which everybody seemed to assume was the purpose of me coming over to try and oppose, uh, has hardly been a matter of any great concern to me here. I've been trying to find out what Great Britain thinks of the future for the Federation. Now, are you satisfied with what you found out? Well, I wouldn't say I'm satisfied. I'm still uh, examining what the discussions have produced, and uh, I'm hoping that in the not too distant future we may find out what Britain's intentions are. There's been a lot of talk lately about fighting and going the whole hog. How close um, do people in Rhodesia feel to a situation in which they would fight? Well, of course, you must understand that Rhodesians uh, and I think I speak for them, seeing that I'm, I have four generations in my own family. The Rhodesians feel very strongly about their own country. Uh, they aren't, as many people seem to think, people who've just come in and have earned a living and are in the process of getting out. The Rhodesians are deep into the soil of, uh, of their country. They will not, in my opinion, uh, tolerate a state of affairs in which they were pushed round. They are a, a liberal people. They've spent uh, a great deal of their wealth on education and trying to advance the Africans and find it very difficult to understand the criticism that is leveled at them from the outside world because they are progressive. Sir so Edward Whitehead said yesterday, or, or, or said things which made him appear impatient for a federal um, constitutional review conference. Well, as you said today that you didn't see much point in one. Does this mean that a, a, a serious disagreement between you on this? Well, as far as I know, there's no disagreement at all. I think what uh, Sir Edgar wants is a change in the federal constitution. I don't personally see that a review conference is likely to achieve it. We had one conference uh, about 12 or 18 months ago, and it was a complete waste of time and absolutely important. And could I have just one comment on Mr. Coender's allegations of treason? Um, well, what's your answer to him? Well, I think, as I said to the British press, I thought it was dribble.